In this video, I'll be covering a free AI feature on Shopify that can help to make your store look a lot more professional, and it can also possibly speed up the amount of time it can take for you to create your full Shopify store. This tutorial is beginner friendly, and also I know a lot of you guys might be new to the Shopify platform. Your store may be on a trial plan right now. Before you guys make a huge commitment to decide between which long-term Shopify plan you would like to choose, I do have a way that you guys can get an extended trial plan on Shopify. When you use my sign up link, you can get your first three months on Shopify for just $1 when you use my sign up link. This way you can truly test the platform before you choose your long term plan. That sign up link will be in the description box below. Let's get straight into this video. The first free Shopify feature that you'll definitely want to take advantage of for your online store would be Shopify's AI image generator. I'm going to show you where to locate it and also how to generate pictures that match your brand. You want to go in to customize your website. Then specifically, you'll need to add a new section to your website in order to use the image generator. I'm scrolling to the bottom of my website and then I'm gonna hover above the footer section and I'm gonna click add section to template. So for this, I'll be demonstrating with an image banner section. And you can also follow these steps in case you would like to customize a banner for your website you should see a sidebar that's gonna give you all the different editing options for the image banner section. This section allows you to insert two different images or just one single image. So I'm gonna click select and this is where you will see the add files button. And next to that, you should be able to see a generate image button as well. This is gonna allow you to add a prompt so that it can generate an AI image for you. This feature can be great for if you don't have too many product photos just yet or if you don't have too many main brand photos to add to the homepage or the banner sections of your website. So I'm going to be adding in an example prompt. So here is my prompt. So I've inserted my prompt and you can add prompts to describe product photography similar to the type of products that you sell on your store. You can also specify in the prompt the sort of aesthetic that you would like the overall image to have. So I'm having it generate an image of a few handbags in a boutique. This could end up being a good photo to add to one of the website banners. Then you're gonna notice it is gonna start generating the photo for you. And in case you change your mind, you can click the stop button. While this is generating, I've opened ChatGPT and I'm also gonna show you how you can use ChatGPT to help you in generating a prompt so that you can have a more detailed prompt. Here is my prompt that I've typed into ChatGPT and I've asked it to generate a picture for the black handbags. And you can specify the quality and the style that you would like the picture to have and maybe even let ChatGPT know what you'll be using the image for. That way they can give you the best prompt for what you need. I'm gonna click generate and then you should see the detailed prompt that ChatGPT has created for you. This is great for if you're not too good at writing prompts from scratch. I've opened up that Shopify browser again and here is the photo that it has generated. If you would like to generate a new photo, you can go ahead and ask it that here in this chat box. And then to download the photo, you want to hover over it and then click the download button. And that should download it to your device. When you click keep, it's gonna add that photo to your inventory of photos. Don't forget, you can add those AI photos to different parts of your website, including any of your header images, your product category covers, and any other sections that you would like to add them to in your website. Also, if you do like the style and the layout of this website, this is one of my clothing boutique theme templates that I've designed for apparel and accessory businesses. I do have this Shopify theme along with a line of other Shopify themes for in case you would like to save the time from creating and designing your website completely from scratch. Using a Shopify theme can help you to build your website and have a professional look and layout to display your different collections, your services, and more without you having to spend a ton of time. If you're not too familiar with Shopify themes, the template will arrive in a zip file format. And when you open Shopify, then go to your homepage you'll be able to upload that website theme straight into your store. And you can publish it and begin editing it and adding your products. Most of my Shopify templates are template bundles, so they do include an installation guide with instructions and screenshots to show you how to install the Shopify theme. I have a wide variety of Shopify templates for different types of business niches, including skincare, dropshipping, and even coaching businesses. My theme bundles also include additional templates like web banner templates, logo templates, and more. If you're looking to save the time from having to design and lay out your website from scratch, you can grab one of my Shopify themes from my website, which I will link in the description box below. When you click generate image again, 
This is where I'm going to copy this ChatGPT prompt and I'm going to paste it in to see what kind of image it generates based on this particular prompt. You may also want to read over the prompt and make any edits or changes that you would like. The AI image generator can help you to save time from browsing through stock photos online and it can also help you to generate close to the exact photos that you would like for your brand instead of you having to choose between stock footage. And here is the photo that it has generated based on that ChatGPT prompt. In my opinion, I really like this photo, but in a moment I'll test out the different photos to see which one I prefer. I've just downloaded this to my computer and then I'm gonna click keep. I'm also gonna generate one last image and then I'm going to download this as well. Then back to editing this image banner section, I'm gonna insert one of those pictures to the background of the photo. Then you can customize the section however you would like. I'm gonna remove this container then I'm also going to customize the text. And here's how that finished banner looks with the AI image added to the background. You can also click this mobile icon to view the appearance of how this section is gonna look on a mobile device. And in case you would like to add two photos to the background instead of just one, you want to click select next to second image. This way you can insert another image onto the background of this banner section. In a moment, I'm gonna show you another AI feature that Shopify has that can help you with your website's product photos and your brand photos. Next, I'm gonna show you another Shopify AI feature that you can use for your product photos. On Shopify, you'll want to open your products page and here you can open up an existing product or you can also create a brand new product. You want to scroll down to the media section of the product information page and under media is typically where you would add your photos and your videos of your product so I'm going to upload one of those AI generated images and once the image has uploaded, you'll want to go ahead and click on it and this is going to open up a mini editor that will allow you to actually customize this image. Not only can you retitle the image and also crop and resize it, but you can also change the background of the image. When you click color background, it's going to detect the background of the image so that you can change the background of your picture. If you don't like the colors that they have listed, you can also create a brand new custom color. Then in case you would like to set a brand new AI background for the image, let's say you like the heels on this image, but not the original background, you'll want to click replace background. And this is going to analyze the image so that it can create an AI background. First, you want to describe the subject of the photo. So I've typed in a pair of heels. And then you want to describe the type of background you would like it to add. Once you've described the background, you'll want to click generate so that it would generate a few different backgrounds for the photo. Also, if you have any troubles creating prompts, don't forget you can always use ChatGPT to write out some detailed prompts for you. And now it's done and these are the different backgrounds that it has generated for this image. As you can see, it allows you to actually optimize the AI image even more in case you would like to change the background of the image. Once you've selected the background that you like the best, you can click save and that's gonna save those changes and then let's say you want to use this image and add it to your website or your homepage. You can always just download this image and it should download straight to your device. And that's how to use the AI background feature on Shopify. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Don't forget if you are interested in this Shopify template, I will have this link in my description box below. And I also have a wide variety of other types of Shopify templates designed for clothing, apparel, beauty, and many other types of businesses. If you're not too familiar with Shopify theme templates, after your order, you're gonna receive it in a theme zip file format. And here on Shopify, you'll have the option to install that theme zip file straight into your store. You'll be able to edit the sections and you'll be able to add your pictures and products. Most of my Shopify themes are template bundles, so they do include other templates like logo templates, banner templates, and more. Those will be linked in my description box below. Thank you all so much for watching.